Yeah, I was about to say, as long as I don't get killed by a keys here. That was destined for failure. The moment I got beat up across the bridge, that run wasn't going anywhere. Um, I shuffled the arrow purchase to after levels four and eight and decided to give the, the mugger a heart. And then after, basically eight goes after four. After completing four, take the recorder over to first quest two, get the coast heart, get the raft, take any. That's kind of the big one. At which point, my hearts are back up to where they should be. I can record her from there to see first quest 5. Clear level 8. And at this point, I, I, I'm basically saving the money. From the... Uh, I should bomb this hole first. From paying the mugger in level 4. I don't have to grind it out. And I still have time to purchase the arrows. Wow, that room happened. Yeah, I, uh, there, the run was a catastrophe, except for the part where it finished two minutes faster. But everything else about it was a catastrophe. Which means everybody got their wish about me getting into top five. Because it apparently happened. Despite going, leaving level two 30 seconds behind. And then there was misrouting elsewhere in there. So basically, I saved at least two minutes. I don't need that heart. I never left my house. I started home. bad. So the other thing I could do <laughs> I'm getting this far. I'm gonna up an A. <laughs> I'm getting enough money I could actually probably consider dropping that too. At which point I wouldn't get the power bracelet until after I get the ladder. In fact, what I'd probably do... I could get that after... Stuff. I don't know. I'm basically... This entire route exercise is shifting money to different places. Also, I'm now buying the arrows after a recording to the three spot. and then buying arrows on this shop on the way up here. Nice. Nice shot, Jensen. a step over I might have gotten a sword beam off to kill something else mm. 
need a bomb. Was this one of the runs where I had, like, extra bombs at some point? So if I go right, I need a bomb. I think I don't need one this way? Bad health for Gliok again. Get the key. Don't forget the key. Yeah, this one finished 20 seconds up, so this is good. Slightly early split, I think. I am sorely tempted to buy bombs. I was sitting here trying to figure out why I was already on the recorder. It's because I'm out of bombs. I got auto switched to it. That's why I should go to the top route, especially if I'm up and in anyway. Well, I finally did that, and now I know why I don't do that. Realistically, right? I'm saying I can cut out a third one of the later 30s, but I need that later 30 to buy the arrows. Yeah. Well, there's a lot more moblins to kill here. There's a lot of blue enemies I can take out before I have to. That's the other thing I could do with my extra rupees is I could 
buy bombs at the gift shop. So I guess that's that's going to be the backup then, isn't it? If I can't get a bomb... There it is. He hungers for more! That was bad. Let's just do this. I think I ran around a little bit last time, too, and ended up uh, waiting for a fairy. to go in a minute if I don't hear anything. Two second menus. already over the point where it's no longer productive to keep collecting rupees. I would need to cross the next 30 barrier for it to uh, be a, a thing that mattered. See all these hits I'm taking? That's why I went to the fairy fountain. I don't need to kill. So what I was playing around with previously was getting uh, the arrows right here, right now. I have so many rupees. That is the fork in the road right there. I should probably go to level three. Well, if I go to level three first. Well, it doesn't matter anymore. Well, no, it does. It kind of does. This feels questionable. Ok, 
Okay, nothing from the Wallmasters. That's not great, actually. Because this 38 needs to become... A, uh... That needs to become an, an 80. And there's 10 in level 4. So I need to find another 31. Yeesh. I need to find another 30. Still getting the white sword first. sitting on the ground. What? I was there! Oh my goodness. I didn't cheat the game. I only cheated myself. This room is awful. I'm just glad I didn't take the third hit. But yeah, that's why I took that heart earlier. Gibdo dropped the clock. I really should have killed the uh, Pole's voice first. What's up, Victress? Spooky ghost cab. That's about right. Health total is spooky. I think that heart I originally grabbed is really only worth half a heart, but still. Just worth half a heart just by virtue of I think I was only missing half a heart.
Oh, that's good. That's really good. Is this as far as the previous run got and I only had three bombs? Heart, I should say. I know it's not going to give me a bomb from that. fairy let me try to do it that way all right I think I'm mostly upset that I couldn't employ bombs because I need to start doing that there and be aggressive with my explosives So I'm at one, two. No, I was at three, so that's one, two. No, that's four, one. Okay, 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 okay. Did I grab the ten rupees from the side room? I think I did. Um, I am really short on money then. Four, which is really five. And now it's like I never left. Take the boost, I guess. Ow.
Alright, I'll be okay because I can get the five rupees off the Mulder Worm. I should be able to get those five anyway. <clears throat> I have to make sure I actually kill one of the bats because that probably would adjust the sprite limit in my favor. That's my arrow money. So the only thing that went wrong in the previous run was that I accidentally recorded, I, I went about doing what I'm about to do after I get the magical sword here. Well, after four. And then had to, after doing level five, do eight and get the magical sword. Which was just, it was awkward, but not terrible. So after 8, I recorded back to uh, the f level 4 island to do the recorder up to 6. So I basically lost the time it took to go back to 4 island. Which at the end of the day isn't that much. Um, I last recorded to five. Seven. Bottom left corner. Not my the screen below this screen. So it's one screen faster to go there. So we'll save that time, too. Arrowed! I have to play the Trog Door game again. I have so many board games that I want to play, and there's one board game I, like, will actually play. Get out of that mess. Get into this mess. So yeah, the uh, the hypothetical I switch routes is I get there with my eight bombs and a white sword and have to figure that room out that way. Switching to bombs is nice, but it's an extra menu as well. But it's almost needed to kill that, clear that room fast while all the wizards are basically in the same spots.
I didn't know that was my last rupee. And that I had exact ammo. <laughs> Take the bomb drop, I guess. I didn't use I didn't need it though. Gimme cash. Yeah, I have two arrows. This, this room drops a five. Manhandle will often drop a five if stabbed to death. It's really the same reason Manhandle will also often drop a bomb if bombed to death. You get the kills on the middle section that don't exist. It does also mean I get the time save of having the magical sword on Gleok specifically. Um, I recorded to seven. I want to record her to seven. One. Oh, come on. Spawns are different. All right, I have one in front of me. Should I go for the big boy strat? Or the big kid strat? Let's go for it. I can't believe that was first try. I really can't believe that was first try. I've already run out of money in this seat. I'm getting that one. That's bad. Is that bad? I think that's actually fine. That's normally really bad. Money is really tight in the seat, it's true. I keep saying that. It's like I'm gonna have practice at killing him. All right, so any full health refill will remove the red bubble curse. That includes fairies, potions, and the Triforce. What did I say? I lost like 12 seconds in the end. Ah, oh, I went to seven, one, Two. I'm kind of sad a blue moblin didn't get in my way. I guess it knew that I was here for its bombs and it wanted to maintain its structural integrity. I can kill red dark notes. Paul's voice aren't worth it. I 
This was not the room I thought it was. I thought it was this room. Push the block. Push the block. Victress, when are you playing randomizer? You got everybody talking about this being a low money seed, which is absolutely true. Victress, when are you playing randomizer? I paused not on the screen I really wanted to, but I'm going to switch to arrows anyway. Alright, I got a hit in. Did I have like a terrible Goma last time? It's too loud. Victress, play randomizer. Zelda 3 randomizer is open treasure chests of the game. Zelda 1 randomizer is a lot more, let's take everything you know about Zelda 1 and mix it up. You still have the problem of you have to kill blue wizards and blue dark nuts. How are we doing? Was I looking for bombs last time? Is that what happened? I'm not out of here yet, though, actually, and this is only a few seconds apart. This refill was way too long. I went to two, three, four. Five. Six. Hit left when I should hit right. Let's do this room properly. I keep not doing this room properly. I probably did that room slower, but I also didn't get hit. So you'd think I'd keeping beam sword, but this room exists. What am I doing with beam sword?
That's actually not bad, because now I have silver arrows. I can throw at the blue lamos. The danger noodles. There, I have to clear a danger noodle room in this run. This is Red Bubbles, the game. Oh. Don't need those. This is the eight. I don't know why I call this the eight room. That's the one. That's one of the few turnstile rooms I think I actually must clip. My path is clear up here. This room is evil. I still need to kill Ganon relatively quickly. I, I didn't have the god Ganon I had in the 47. But I didn't exactly have a terrible Ganon. I have enough health I can go in on Patra. Get bombed. Tch. Plenty of health. And they called him Fred. That's a good Ganon. Not gonna sub five the dungeon, but you know, cool. I am gonna sub 44 by accident though. Yeah, I actually, I think the big thing here is I kept health through level nine and that made it so that when I got to the patches at the end, It apparently made 20 seconds of difference. That I could just kind of say, Alright, let's do it! Fourth in uh, Yes Up A is a 40. So, nowhere near that, but hey... Blue Ring has a 43. Not that I know if Blue Ring doesn't have a 40 there as well. Um, still no advancement on anybody else for the no up A department if you're kind of looking at that. Be because there's no real cross posting. There should be. But I'm at least within the same minute range now as two more times. I think I'm just calling it here for now because tomorrow's going to be a little crazy. Have the, uh, the family relaxing time. Thanks everybody for dropping in and 
HJ, thanks for the raid. Join the Mega Man 9 tournament, everybody. That's... Oh, my God. I need to do Mario 3 and Luigi U and get something that I can actually submit to uh, the thing, the Calathon. This is, uh, this is at least going somewhere. Ugh. Yeah, sub 44 somehow. Thanks. It's like if I play this game a lot, things happen. <laughs> Thanks for the bits. The 100 Pog Champs. Thank you so much. Um. Oh my goodness. I don't even know where to go. I'm going to go to Lack. And then, uh. I will say that PJ is playing X6, and I don't know what's going on there. And I think I see... There, there's enough other Zelda going around if you want to do it, but we're going to go to Lack.